Oh, yeah. There have been reports of Germans infiltrating this area? Well, you, you can rest easy, General Bronson. I'm suspicious of everybody. Well, nice talking with you, General. I'll check our security immediately. Goodbye. Carpenter! Coming, Captain. Yes, sir, what is it, Captain? Carpenter, have you seen anyone sneaking around here lately, you know, snooping around and... Uh... Mm, no, sir, no, not that I recall. Oh, oh, just a minute. Oh, yes, sir, yes, sir. Yesterday morning, right outside your office, outside I saw... my office? Yes, sir. Well, don't just stand there. Let's go. Well, Maybe sir, we can we... spot him again. That's probably the spy. Oh, the sp oh, no, sir, he couldn't be a spy. It was General Bronson. Well, I don't care who it was. I'm suspicious of everybody. General Bronson. I... Bronson. General... How could he be a spy? What's the matter with you? They'd be better off if they'd left you home and drafted your kitty car. <laughs> who is it? Captain Bingleton? I'm Captain Bangleton. I have sealed orders from General Bronson. Well, hand them over, boy. Hand them over. They're top secret, sir. You'll have to identify yourself. <sighs> identify myself? Carpenter, tell him who I am. He is Captain Bingleton. Hey, give me the orders. I'm sorry, sir. Your dog tags? My dog tag? <laughs> I think this is carrying things a little bit too far to... <laughs> Would you like to see the dimple on my right knee? Oh, no, sir. Your records state no identifying marks. I'm sorry, sir, but General Bronson's orders are for top security. Sign here, please. Oh. No identifying marks. And it's pushy enough to be a second lieutenant. <laughs> 